Before he got on the plane. <laughs> what the oh, fuck? Up. Nah. What? Maybe a little dirty. Delay. Expensive. Annoying. Careless. All around just awful. But like we always say here at the Bright Airlines, what other choice do you have? What other choice do you have? I like that. I like that. Stay home. That was dope. Alright. So, first off, They said they don't work for us. And I was like, what do you mean you don't work for us? Like, you're, you're customer service, you know what I mean? So, I would never get on this plane in my life. There's a good chance you're gonna die. There's a good chance you're not gonna be satisfied. You're gonna catch some. You There's... might you might go into the little folder compartment thing and, and touch something you don't want to touch. Oh, you don't wanna do that. Yeah. That's disgusting. You, you, you also might press the button 
somebody gonna come help you, and then they just gonna press the button and say no. <laughs> Bro, that's. I was like, like, nope. I was like, that's some savage shit right there. Like, cause I've been on a plane and I've pressed that button before. And if she would have just walked past me, pressed the button, and then kept it moving. Oh, that's uh, that, that 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 that's rude. I would have been a DJ. I would have been a DJ on that plane. Like, do 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 do. How you gonna how you gonna have a, how you gonna have somebody just just run? How you gonna have a pilot? Randomly pressing buttons and stepping on a journey. How you gonna tell the people to save yourself before you save the kid sitting beside you? Like, did you not see the kid wheezing like he was about to die? <laughs> yeah, <I saw> that. <laughs> like, what the fuck? The TV dinners though? Nasty ass shit. They gave TV dinners to the to the people. I remember eating those. And then she was eating shrimp out of a glass, like shrimp cocktail, <laughs> like what? Oh my gosh. Oh. If y'all if y'all say y'all would get on this plane, y'all crazy as hell, man. <laughs> y'all crazy as hell. I, I would never get on this plane in my life. And I won't like oh Imagine turbulence on that plane. The captain wouldn't say nothing. He no. wouldn't warn you of turbulence. He probably wouldn't even tell you if they were about to fall. Like, oh my gosh. Nah. For, for those of y'all that fly, y'all might be taking this a little serious. You know what I mean? Because you want to live when you're on a plane, you know? You don't want to be like, is the, is the captain even flying? You done? I thought I had a sneeze. My bad. That was dramatic. Um, but, uh... Yeah, man. I would never, ever get on this plane, bro. Ever in my life. And I hope y'all don't either. I hope nobody gets on this plane. But this was a good video, though, to be honest. This was a dope video. Uh, shouts out to the dude that was sitting in the chair and all those feet was, like, popping up around him. I wouldn't have done that scene. But I'm, I'm pretty sure they didn't claim, though. I don't care. <laughs> I wouldn't have done that scene. You know, did you see how many feet was around him yeah. in that part? And then he smiles and thumbs up, like, I love feet. Then you got the farting dude too. <laughs> I've had a farting dude. It was a it was a Hispanic dude sitting in front of me on a plane on my way to Vegas, I think. I think it was Vegas. It was either Houston or Vegas. It was Hispanic dude. I think it was Houston, because I did not know it was that many Hispanics that live in Houston. Shouts out to the H Town if y'all out there. I ain't know y'all had that many Hispanics out there, bro. I got off that plane and I was like, where the fuck am I, bro? Like, are you sure this is Houston? Like, for real. But, shouts out to y'all. But this one Hispanic dude that I was on the plane with was farting. Like, you sure he was farting? I'm positive. Like, I can smell it every time he farted. Like, I couldn't hear him, but I could smell it. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, so you just gonna act like you're not farting and ain't nobody behind you. I wanted to smack the shit out of his head. So <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. So, but, but that wasn't as worse as the one as the time that you was on the airplane. And you had that that big ass dude that was sitting. <laughs> the way you described him, like I was squished on the window, bro. Like it was so bad. You <laughs> were so pissed to feel his body heat all on my arm. Like That's disgusting. <laughs> and his, and his, like he, he was sweaty too. Like you got to sleeve, trust me. Short sleeves on. Yeah, he has short sleeves? Short? Or long yeah. Sleeves. Oh, that's the worst. He has short sleeves on him. And he was just so... He, went, he, he, he wouldn't cool down, like, at all. <laughs> <laughs> he just would not cool down. And I'm just sitting here like... You know the worst part about that plane trip? Is the plane was packed. And I was sitting all the way in the back. And um, the last couple people was getting on. And he was one of them. And I'm like... Please don't come all the way to the back. Because it was me on the window seat. And then it was this older woman on the uh, outdoor seat. So it was a middle seat free. And I'm like, please don't let this dude come all the way to the back. Like, like <laughs> I'm, I'm legit going to spaz if, that, if I ever get in that situation again. I'm going to be like... <laughs> I'm gonna be like, look at this seat. I just like, I just want to be there when that happens. <laughs> I'm like, look at this seat. Look I'm, at you. This I'm is be, not going to work. I'm, I'll be laughing at it shit. Was so, it was the worst flight I've ever been on in my life. My leg, Look at this seat. <laughs> my legs was cramped. Uh, I, I, oh, it was so bad. And uh, you, need, you need that. What's that? You need that soul plane. I'm like plane. going to legit take first class tickets or something for now on. Because if I ever get in that situation, <laughs> I'm not flying. Oh my god! And the worst part is when you finally land and you gotta wait for everybody to get off the plane, 
and you still just sitting there cramped? Why can't we all just be able to fly, bro? I don't even think we did questions. We talking too much. It's time for us to start. Asking all them questions. Asking all them questions. How did you feel about this video? Are you subscribed to Nigga Higa? Are you subscribed? Have you seen this video before and did you come here for our reaction? Number three is important. What was your favorite part of this video? Um, I think my favorite part is when she was like, and we don't work for you. It's like, damn, yeah. Um, I'm about to go my favorite part was the, um, pulling down the, what do you call those things? Over this, like, uh, oxygen mask. Yeah, and to be like, just, you know, worry about yourself first. Don't, don't worry about your kid or your yeah. baby. I think another one of my favorite parts is when the dude was talking about, uh, how, uh, delivering, or, you know, putting the baggage, putting their bags uh, in the plane and shit. And, like, they didn't care. <laughs> shit. Even if it said fra uh, fragile, he would just throw it. Watch that yeah, shit. Yeah, so. If y'all got a favorite part, let us know in the comment section below. We hope y'all enjoyed the video. Straight like that. Oh, one more thing. What is, like, when you're on the airplane, what's your, like, worst, like, kind of people to be next to on the plane? Have y'all had any bad airplane experiences? Exactly. Thank you for that. I was yeah. trying to go. Yeah. He's an overthinker here. This kid. If y'all had any bad experiences, let us know in the comment section below. Because I had one. I'm pretty sure somebody can relate to me out there. And, uh... Yeah. Your favorite seat? The window, the middle, or the aisle seat? Window seat. Come on, bro. Window side? <laughs> so, oh, <you> know. <laughs> Keep it cool. Keep it classy. We love you. Stay awesome. Always. And forever.